Hello guys, welcome back to Sim Shack. Welcome back to me, Sim UK. We've almost instantly got another rescue mission to go deal with. So um, I've just taken the boat to the shipyard, fixed her up, got her all repaired. So we're back up to 100%. And um, the weather has improved. It's much nicer today. I love spinning this boat round. I know the physics are rubbish, but I still enjoy doing that. Let's go find this boat. It's not too far out. It's not as close as the last one. But, irrespective of where they are, they need rescuing. So, get myself lined up. Woohoo! Wee! <laughs> All over the place. All over the place. Right, where's my. Also, pilot on. Lay the boat right down because I'm really nervous that we're going to hit something. Don't trust the autopilot all that much. And there's that bit in the center over there, look. There's loads of rocks around here. This is a dangerous bit of water. I'm not sure it's safe to have autopilot on here. Perilously close to hitting both of these tiny little rock outlets. Look at that, it's taking me straight towards it. Oh my word. Like a flipping roller coaster ride, it's horrible. It's way too close for comfort. Bacon sandwich just arrived. And a cat. Better move the bacon sandwich then. Right, well, you know, autopilot has it under control. We can whack up the speed. I think we're safe now. Safe enough. There are still loads of rocky little outpatches everywhere. bacon sandwiches. Hmm. Oh my word. What is going on? Uh oh. Covered in ketchup. Heading straight towards those rocks. Oh, hang on, there's a turn coming. A boat close by is caught on fire. Oh, wow. The mission has turned into a super mission. Oh, I see it. I see it. Oh gosh, which one do I prioritise? Right, I can see the boat. Wow. Two, this is how quick they've come round now. I've got two stranded ships and a, fire, a ship on fire. All in the space of, like, 
well, almost at the same time. But we're here now, so it'll be rude to turn around and go back, wouldn't it? God, could you imagine that if you're on a stranded boat, you saw your rescue boat come and then they turn around and left? Horrible feeling. <clears throat> is it a different boat again or is it the same as the last one? Different to tell, isn't it? I think it is different. Yeah, cool. Looking forward to having a co-op multiplayer session on something like this. God, ketchup has oozed out. It's all over my fingers. Not close enough. It is a different boat. Totally different. Oh, God. I only tapped it to go forward like a, a smidge. Excuse me, cat. Thank you. Right, hopefully that should be close enough. Yeah, that's good. Tow line is on. Let's go. We haven't got Trying to mess about. Excuse me, cat. Thank you. Oh, the tow line snapped. Wow. I was going too fast. That's so cool. Okay, well, I have to. I have to take my time. Last time I did it just for immersion purposes, but. If you don't, the tow line will actually snap. That is awesome. Right. I've got to get to this boat that's on fire, for goodness sakes. Right, come on. Keep the speed down this time. Come on, boat. It's rolled over. What's going on with this boat? Is it anchored or something? Oh my god, I've rolled it. Oh, it's turning into a nightmare. Let's move closer to tow, but it's upside down. I don't know if I can do it now. Can't dive in. Man, what am I going to do? I don't think I can tow it because it's upside down. Oh, hang on. All right, we are good. Right, let's try going really slow. I feel like it's stuck there or something. Do you know what I mean? It's not moving so much. If anything, it's holding us up. Caught on something. Oh, I hit it. Oh, the controls on these boats are awful. Alright, last try. If I can't get it now, I can't get it, can I? Move closer to tow, so... 
I have to be at the front of the boat. <sighs> Give it a gentle nudge. See if we can get it to move. It's not a gentle nudge. I have managed to move it a bit. Last try. It either comes now or we leave it forever. That's something bugged out about that boat. We're going to have to leave it. There's a ship on fire. Priorities have changed. I'm sorry. So if we head back to Rost, it's kind of around the back there somewhere. It's interesting. That was really cool. I like the fact that the uh, the rope snapped, but, you know, I tried to do it slower and more carefully, and it still snaps, so I can only assume that it's bugged out. No idea how to control the remote fire hose either. Ah, there, yeah, cool. Okay. That's our first rescue mission that failed. <laughs> and we're straight off to another one already. And that is a good bacon sandwich. dangerous you can see a lot of rocks and breaks there but you know, in a serious rush there's a boat on fire I've already taken too long Made me panic. Um, damn it. Um,
I do feel like the boat on fire should be the priority. <coughs> There's only so long a boat can be on fire before it's completely done, you know? Like at the moment it says find and tow the rowboat. We've got 21 hours remaining. So if I go into my around here see if you can see it whoa A dangerous bit of water this never been up here either It is, it's just over there. So if I go tab, missions, extinguish fire, see so you've got 22 hours. I think that's too long. Oh, I see it, I see it. We shouldn't have 22 hours to put it out though. That's way too much time. All right, we'll try and approach it from the side. There should be people in the water, so you have to be careful as you approach. Don't know how much range this thing has. I have to get closer than this. I don't see any water coming out. Oh, you can change to that camera. That's cool. There's no water. Why is there no water? I bet I've got to get closer. I bet I've got to get really close. I, I've got a feeling you got to be right up its bottom. That's pretty cool, though. That's, I mean, look at that. That is awesome. close to it now. Change camera. It's still not spraying any water. Why isn't it working? It's very difficult for me to put the fire out without any water. <clears throat> Which in the current context just seems a ridiculous thing to say. <clears throat> okay, let's try getting it just a smidge closer. Wipers on. It's not working, is it? It's not bloody working.
and it's floating away. Try it from a few different sides. It's really close, yeah. Phone's going out. I'm guessing there's just no water animation or something. Wow, we did it! But it, I don't see how. <laughs> so weird. Uh, okay. So now that it's out, don't I have to tow it back to to shore or something? Oh yeah, tow boat to rescue zone. Where's the rescue zone? That's why I couldn't take that boat, because I hadn't accepted the mission. You spanner. Uh... Right, okay. Lesson learnt. Where's the boat gone? Where's it gone? Weird. I didn't have to tow it back, it just kind of vanished. That's a bit stupid. It should convert from a an on-fire ship to being a, a stranded ship, in my opinion. All right. Well, that was my first fire. We put it out. We did it. We managed to uh, complete the mission. I'm going to go back and get this boat, the one that I flipped over. It's kind of funny. Kind of funny that I cocked that up so much. I wonder if I can flip it back over the other so the other way. So, okay, great. I do think that the line snapping should be a thing if you go too fast. It's quite a heavy boat. I mean, theoretically, you could build up speed over time. You know, gradually increase the speed. That's fine. Because the boat will come with you, but to just connect a rope to it and go flat out straight away I think is madness and should result in the tow line snapping or if it's a really big boat you know you have to go even slower because the tow line will snap even easier Hello cat, standing right in front of my screen is not helpful right now. Oh, we're getting close. We're going to be ready for those tier 3 boats when they arrive.
This is a work in progress, don't forget guys. Early access title. So the fact that that didn't work exactly how it was meant to is not a massive shock. The fact that it works at all is quite a nice surprise. Truth be told, watch out for these shawls. Taking a dangerous shortcut here. Especially with this boat bobbing around like a lunatic. Reminds me of the berserker in Eric the Viking. Oh no! Here you go, see? I thought it was clear and safe. I got caught out. Luckily we didn't take too much damage there. I can come back here and do some repairs. Oh well. Wow. Oh yeah, ten percent I can do fifty repairs. Sure, I'm not heading straight towards some rocks, which I absolutely am. Get away from the edge, just in case. And I can see the boat is still out there, and I think it's still upside down. It was quite kind of funny that I flipped it over. It's a lesson learnt right there. Has it righted itself? No. Cool. Okay. So we're going to try and tow this in upside down, see what happens. Physics are just awful. going to be close enough. Maybe it is. Let's try. Yeah. Back it up just a little bit. close right this time it should come with us but we'll take it slow because obviously a it's upside down and b we've already smashed it apart a bit i think it would be nice as well if you know if we inflict damage on the boat then uh, we become liable for a certain amount you know behaving now um right let's just put a nice safe route together
he says. Right. <clears throat> Interestingly, the autopilot sort of picks your speed. I don't think you can adjust it right now. You used to be able to adjust it. At the moment, all we've got is an on-off switch. Still. It's coming. Boat is a-coming. As upside down as it is, it's coming. Right, it's a little bit risky, but I can go repair the rest of the boat now. I can do 10% repair. There go, that's it, that's all I can do at sea. Way! We still got a boat? Yes, we do, thank goodness. Lots to feed back on for the devs. Oh. Hello there, look. Another shallow. Pretty cool, I think the game's evolving rather nicely. It's fun to be out here doing all these different things, not just fishing all the time. Definitely breaks things up, makes things more interesting. Keeps you busy and active as well, which is nice. Bit nervous about this. Lots of rocky outreach. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's not good. No. Autopilot. Needed to intervene there. <coughs> and we hit the boat as well. Still there though, just about. Yeah, that was a frightening moment there. The autopilot nearly killed us. Got to be careful. I mean, if we were going slower, I think it would be fine. Because we go absolutely flat out. I don't have any control over the speed, I don't think. Because the autopilot just sort of turns it on and does what it wants. is fun keeps the game interesting and fresh they could do so much with this do rescues i mean rescues alone would be fantastic just having people in the sea and you know a general area where they are you got to turn up and try and find them and if you don't they drown and then you got that on your conscience i think brilliant it's um I mean, not brilliant, obviously, but, you know, if you want something realistic, that would be it. Not to trivialise anything, of course. Oh, here we are. slowly drag the boat. Is it still there? Oh, it's, behind, it's beside me now. I 
Wonderful. Right, there's no point in docking because we've got another boat to go rescue. Oh god, the damage. Oh, the damage. Just let us push away from the dock, for goodness sakes. Such a simple thing to request. Right, where's the other one? That's a long way away. I can't go anywhere over there at all. Hmm. We have to drive some of it and navigate the uh, the the end of it. The map is not accurate, is it? At all. Crazy, I can't put a flag anywhere. Right. Let's do that. Hit the navigation bubble. And then just keep an eye out on the way. Why is it going that way? The first flag is up there. Still, maybe this will give me a my tier tho tier I can't even speak. Tier three ticket. Licence, I should say. Oh, it looks like there's some shallows there. Yeah, I'm not gonna risk that. Yeah, there's shallows all the way across there. I only just saw them at the last second. We've already taken quite a bit of damage. Very dodgy. It's four kilometers, lovely. Go rescue this boat. What a busy day. What a busy day. We had nothing to do, and all of a sudden, we had loads to do. It 
So I want to give some feedback to the devs on this. I can't do it right now. Oh man, I've got ketchup all over me. I don't use any of it. It did ooze out. I must have bitten into it and it just went. It's quite dark in here, so I can't see anything. Clean t shirt, straight in the wash. Lovely. Although well, it smells nice and tomatoey now. I haven't got it anywhere else. Turn the light on in a minute and have a proper look. Right, Binox out. Check for nicely little rock formations. Oh, I think I see the boat. See it already. It's pretty groovy, isn't it? I'm, uh, I'm quite a long way away. I can already see the boat. That's awesome. I can't see it now, but if I get the binox out, there it is. You'll just about see it by squinting. I've got REM's night swimming stuck in my head. Night swimming. Or in my case, night fishing deserves a quiet night. Right, looks like there's a bit of land popping up on the map, but I don't see it. We appear to be heading straight for it. No collision thus far. One day these charts will be uh, more realistic and more accurate. And they'll give us actual depths. Gonna work out which end is the front. Perfect. We can just come alongside. Delicious. Ahoy there! Be nice to come out and save your friends, wouldn't it? Like you'd be doing loads of AI missions and then occasionally your friend will be like I've had an electrical failure 
My boat is drifting. Please come and get me. That would be very cool. Right. I'm hoping that's close enough. Yes, it is. Let's tow this bad boy back to base. So unrealistic that I just take off. <laughs> Let's go! Everyone <laughs> gets whiplash. Right. Yep, it's going back to Rost. We must be close now, look at that. We should have our tier three and level 11 by the time we get back. Excellent. plan on having a lie-in this morning recover all the energy that I've dispensed over the week but um, county wife and argumentative daughter decided that was not on the card for me I bet you tomorrow it'll be on the cards for the wife I don't mind that because I've got the footy to watch golf to watch loads of fun stuff Keeps me occupied. Do 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 no. Nope. Like really close together, no? I think what should happen on the map is it shouldn't restrict you from putting flags in locations that will collide with the land. It should be your responsibility not to do that. Just wanted to get a shot on that. Yeah, this is cool. Once the physics are done and the water splashes on the windows and the audio is improved, it's going to be a proper, proper sim. That's my daughter. She didn't want to come in for some reason. So I could come up here and slip between these islands and come around this way, or I could just come around this way. Oh, look, now it's bloody working. No? Yeah, this is... Oh! Oh, nasty. I didn't even see that. Autopilot off. Oh, my God. Everything is hitting me. The boat we're towing is hitting me. We're hitting the rocks. Just 
Just when you think everything's going fine, all of a sudden nothing's going fine. And that's what I love. I made a mistake and I'm paying dearly for it. There you go. That's what we want to see. That's a lot of damage right there. Didn't even see that shallow at all. I, knew, I could see it was getting close to the to the island. I didn't realise there were all those rocks sticking out. I've got myself in a right situation here. I'm going to have to self-navigate very carefully. He says at maximum speed. <laughs> One day when the physics are fixed, I'll care more. Right now it's just a, a kid's game. And the economics are realistic and the physics are too. And it'll be worth taking the time and effort to sail safely. Try and get out. We've only got 50% of our boat left and I can't repair it anymore manually. Close by cargo mission. Wow, all these missions are popping up like wildfire. Normally you get like one every few days. I've had flipping four or five today. So, I think we're back in the safety of the channel. Almost. Go see if I can repair anything. No. I have to be careful. Yeah, so what happened there was I banged into the rocks, which at high speed, I mean, that should have been 50% damage straight away, I think. Um, and then because I stopped abruptly, the, um, the boat that I'm towing smacked into the back of us as well, which then banged us into the rocks again. It was a calamity of errors and a lot of damage has been sustained. Which is a good thing, I'm not complaining. I'm glad that happened. I was being totally reckless and irresponsible and I paid a price. It serves me right. But I'm a, you know, I've got 80 million kroner in the bank. That's about 8 million English dollars, uh, English pounds, English dollars? What the hell does that mean? So, um, yeah. Like most millionaires, I couldn't really care less. the boat I could buy another one whoop de doo de da actually interestingly 80 million is approximately what Nigel Mansell own, has I don't know how people know this but yeah approximately that's how much money the man has and I think he's such a top bloke I, I really like Nigel Mansell I'd like to meet Nigel Mansell one day shake his hand have a pint with him. He's a top bloke. Really amazing stories, I bet. Right. Slightly off topic, sorry. Let's just ease the boat in. We don't want any more damage if we can help it. Leveled up. That's gained, gained a new skill point. We completed the mission. That was quite a busy day. Looks a bit beaten up, doesn't she? Bless her. Well, that was super cool, guys. Um, we now have a Class 3 
license so when the tier three boats come out we can have them we've got two unused skill points which we can use on i don't know what can we use them on crewmate one engineering basic electrician skilled oiler equipment will wear down 30 percent slower we've got the fire safety thing so that's good uh, yeah, we've got everything we need there. Obviously, gutting is going to come in at some point. Buster reeling. Now, that looks like a proper a reel, like a fishing rod reel. Ooh. Obviously, the cranes are going to get bigger. The medic. This is interesting. Yeah, lots of good stuff to... Uh, Still be looking forward to. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Goodbye for now.